My apologies for the interruption. However, I just want to make people aware. My fan is on and I didn't realize it was making a ticking noise. So if you're very sensitive to sounds, I just want to give you a heads up. Now back to the reading. Greetings, signs and moons, and of course I have to welcome back all my stars. If you're new to the channel, welcome to the mothership. I do appreciate the likes, the donations, the shares, the confirmations you send me through email. The positive energy you show me, the positive energy you show yourself, and overall the positive way you show up in the planet. Now with that being said, let's get in there like a swimwear. All right. So we got, you know, I'm, I'm picking up mother and daughter energy. There could be an investment. Okay, some of you, you're obviously getting some form of assistance from your ancestors. Okay, this could be you nurturing a project, a person, or a vision here. Okay, for some of you, somebody wants to nurture something with you. They see you as marriage material. Okay, you could definitely be a divine feminine, or this is about your divine feminine. If you have a passed over mother, specifically they may be giving you a helping hand okay somebody's definitely focusing on their co career all right but i do feel like there is some form of deception okay now some of you this could be like some some form of institution here maybe somebody feels betrayed by this institution this institution could be a marriage or maybe someone um seeking advice or counsel all right. I feel like somebody was humbled in this situation. Let's see. We have the father of Sims. OK. In reverse. All right. So somebody doesn't feel protected or somebody's no longer wanting to invest in a situation. This could be you or this could be about someone leaving some sort of organization organization or some form of institution. Somebody's having to rethink something here. This, this is like a, a broken alliance is what I'm getting. OK. Um, for somebody, there's a new beginning happening. If this is not you, this is someone that wants to come towards you. I feel like justice is being restored, okay? Somebody may have been seeking some form of revenge or retaliation. Um, maybe because you left a situation or this person left a situation, they don't want to um, nurture this family dynamic or this business is what I'm getting, okay? Oh, yeah. So you may have realized something or somebody realized something about an action that was taken. This, which We're picking up on the energy of some form of creative endeavor, okay? Let's see. Now, you know, I got to remind people and warn people. I got a doppelganger, a copycat, a replica, a clone. A wannabe me, but try and do it better than me. An English professor, a WhatsApp bandit, and a voodoo high priest or priestess. We're all floating through that comment section. But also got a lot of love. That voodoo high priest or priestess is promising to get your love back for a small fee of $39.99. All you got to do is sign your life away on the dotted line. Do not fall for those adult people. If you have to bend someone's will for them to be with you or for you to be with them, they don't need you. <clears throat> and you definitely don't need them. This is past, present, or future energies. Parts may resonate with you. Parts may not. Take what's for you and leave the rest. This could be someone in your environment, someone thinking of you, you are thinking of them. A ex, a co-worker, a passed over loved one. You may or may not know these individuals. Any and all information that you need about me or regarding this reading shall be in the description box below, including the link where you copy and paste that in your browser. And you will receive a free bird chart from a reputable site. No affiliation to me. Okay. Be mindful the scammers are scamming. I will not solicit you for my services. I will not ask you for donations. All right. All my personal sessions are closed when and if I'm able to um, open back up or I'm guided to. I will announce it. Okay. And it will be, you know, the announcement will come to my members or offer to my members first. Okay. Um, we definitely have someone that endured here. Now, this endurance may have been unexpected by your peers or someone that was coming up against you. I feel like somebody was forced to change their perspective or their perception surrounding a business venture or endeavor. Take it how it resonates, okay? You may be working on a craft here. 
All right. Um, I see you as focus and, uh, and ambition. For some of you, you're redoing something. Yeah, you're redoing something. Could be a foundation. Okay. Um, you're working on a generation of wealth here. Okay, or somebody's changing their approach to what they see as success is also what I'm getting. All right. You may have many options or people see you as having many options. Somebody may have tried to put a lot of obstacles in front of you. I feel like you take a different approach or whoever this is, they take a different approach, different avenues to how they manifest. Okay, but this is what. Um, you're being guided to do. Somebody beat out the competition. This is surrounding some sort of work. Now, this like this is like outnumbering someone, okay? Teaming together to do something diabolical in regards to someone's foundation, their work, their gifts, take it how it resonates, okay? So somebody was trying to create some sort of confusion or illusion surrounding someone's finances, home, okay? For some of you, this is about a spouse. Maybe this is your spouse or the spouse of someone that you may be intertwined with, okay? Somebody is greedy, called dependent, maybe a little bit even jealous. People may see this person as smothering as well okay all right this could also have something to do with your mother or this person's mother or the way you were raised okay so we're definitely speaking about exchange of money all right for some of you you may be getting a loan or someone may be asking for a loan i do feel like you're getting assistance for some of you you're being left something passed down something or this person um is okay yeah Possibly by this mother, a mother figure. This mother could be someone that is passed over is also what I'm getting. So keep that in mind. There was some sort of injustice in the past surrounding this offering, this gift. Somebody was trying to take something that didn't belong to them. All right. They didn't want to pay the cost to be the boss. This person did not want to pay dues or somebody does not feel like they have to pay a bill or something like that. OK, so there was some form, some form of divination that was done. OK, somebody was focusing too much on somebody else's business. This is also a sign for you to focus on what you need and not so much what you want. OK, so there may be a financial a financial obstacle or somebody was trying to place a finance, a financial obstacle Somebody passed judgment on you. This is somebody that is getting divination, doing divination. This is someone that um, like spends more than what they make or they spend frivolously. But something was interpreted through some form of divination about a new opportunity that, you know, caught someone off guard is what I'm picking, picking up. All right. So keep your, your eyes uh, where your focus, keep your mind state trained on what you want to accomplish and not so much what you don't uh, want to accomplish. Somebody has a self-defeatist behavior, okay? It's because somebody wants to be able to live a lavish lifestyle, okay? Um, I do feel like, you know, for some of you, you got this doppelganger, copycat, replica, or clone, right? Um, they may envy you. Or somebody's envious in this situation because somebody works well alone. Now, if this person wanted to collaborate with you, uh, and you may have turned this person down. They presented some sort of illusion to try to have you stuck. Or maybe somebody wants to collaborate with you or you want to collaborate with someone to attempt to keep them stuck. All right. But I do feel like something was turned down uh, in the past here because of what somebody invested OK, or because you didn't want to invest, somebody may have came up against you or you came up against this person. All right. You may pick up on energies really well. If you are subscribed to tier three, there's a reading there for you. Tier three readings is only for tier three. OK, somebody lacks financial discipline. OK. Um, so somebody's trying to explore their their options. This came out on the fence. So we got the seven of wands. You may have had your defenses up against this investment. Okay. You could be a star seed or you were wishing for something, wish fulfillment. Somebody is. 
Okay, somebody could also been doing some work on a star seed or someone that has a high calling on their life. This is something that was being done in secret. Okay, because of uh, of an investment, somebody wants to steer things in their favor. Um, however, with the seven of wands coming out here on the fence like that, um, somebody's having to back out. Okay. Of some form of investment somebody's also paying attention to the charts or analytics maybe doing some research here nine of coins why is this here yeah they're trying to figure out how to um spark some creative venture here um with the nine of wands coming up though uh i feel like you got your boundaries up okay somebody's watching you manifest Okay, um, somebody also may be hearing voices. Okay, um, with the nine of wands and the nine of swords, somebody's being tormented because of some sort of choice or illusion they're trying to present or something that they did in the past. Okay, so somebody's strength is being tested at this time. You can show me what it is I need to see. Yeah, somebody... <sighs> All right, so somebody's trying to break down someone's defenses or they attempted to in the past. This is what they invested in. This is someone or you, my collective, you have a strong defense team uh, spiritual protection or something like that. Okay, this is somebody that was in competition with you. This person felt like because you work solo that possibly they could team up with others to try to defeat you here. Okay, we're talking about the five of sticks here um, in reverse. Okay, so at some point they were working with others. I feel like there's some sort of disarray um, that took place surrounding uh, investment because somebody's defenses was up. If they went up against your spiritual team, they definitely lost with Father of Sims here. Okay, we're talking about temperance energy in reverse. This is like somebody trying to disrupt your peace, causing some sort of chaos and conflict. I feel like you were refusing this conflict. You may feel like you work best alone. Okay, so somebody took it upon themselves to test your patience or this is what they're doing now. They're doing some form of divination or candle uh, magic, trying to gain some success here or trying to do divination without somebody's permission. Okay, to cause somebody to be confused with the seven of baskets here and this nine of swords. I feel like this turn this return immediately. Okay, somebody's protected. They're being protected against these people that want to cause conflict. So somebody's definitely having to change their approach. Or you're attempting to change your approach. Eight of coins. So for some of you, somebody was working against you. Now they want to work with you. Eight of coins. Why is this here? Yeah, six of chalices. I feel like somebody's going to come in and say we are on the same team. We're on the same tribe. They're going to act as if they are friends or this is you. Okay. They're doing this to a divine feminine or somebody that is balanced. Okay. You may be in court with this person. They could be also working with someone that's in court or they want to work with a divine feminine. Okay. Um, with this justice and this king of swords, this is giving me an outside party. Maybe someone that is actually on your side here, watching you work and restoring balance. Okay. I feel like somebody's in some form of litigation. Okay. Or this is like karma. Because somebody was trying to manifest some chaos and some conflict. Okay. Hold on, y'all. 
If you hear me a little bit windy, it's because I hit them stairs, okay? Now, my collective, my stars, my uh, suns and moons, look, you were working hard at, at something, okay? You have multiple people, or this person have multiple people coming up against them, okay? The whole plan was for you to give up, all right? Somebody deals with facts and figures, charts, measurements, analytics, okay? And the last, well, not the last reading, the reading, the readings that I did over the weekend, it talked about a CPA, all right? I kept wanting to say CPN. That is significant for those of you that know what a CPN is. So somebody was waiting for the results Okay, of some work that they put in. Now, for some of you, somebody went against you because you didn't want to work with them, for them. They were indecisive here. Whether they should join in this malicious intent. Okay, or somebody is watching you and they feel regretful because they didn't protect you in this situation. So somebody's watching you gain abundance by yourself. You're somebody that works hard. You may actually be on your feet a lot, okay? Or you needed to get grounded or you need to get grounded going um, forward here, especially, especially if you are in a competitive field, okay? You could have branched off on your own, started a new business, or you started doing something differently, okay? You started focusing on your wish fulfillment, okay? Trying to manifest something here. Some of you, there is a, like, like you may have a circle of people that do what it is you do. Somebody deals with balancing the scales and or law, enforcement of law. Um, it could be spiritual law and or physical law with justice here and the king of swords. Okay. Some of you, you could be thinking about a time when you had to work really hard. You may, you may have had to put your defenses up against a lot of people. I feel like you decided not to work with somebody in this situation or somebody else in this uh, endeavor is deciding that they don't want to work. They don't want to work for people, with these people, or something like that. Okay? Um, somebody, somebody is trying to, man, I feel like this is a mother figure that's trying to manifest somebody feel tormented. Okay. This is also someone that did this a lot. And I'm hearing they did this a lot to get where they are. Whether they did this to you or to multiple people. And they could be working with like a group of people here. But you also have allies in this uh, situation. I'm, I'm unforeseen allies. Yeah, this is eight of wands and the eight of coins. This is about an action that was taken or somebody that needs to take action. Yeah, you have unforeseen allies. This is something that was unexpected because outwardly you work alone or you work best alone. You may be coming to that conclusion. You get more things done. So you're having to put your boundaries up, especially against like naysayers. Naysayers. You may be, you may deal with the public a lot or different opinions a lot, especially if you're in law enforcement, but you could be in like a field 
where it is dominated like by masculine men or you have to to take a masculine approach to whatever it is this you are building on like I'm hearing no holds barred but you have to be like you can't be too flirty or people will take your kindness for weak like your kindness for weakness here gully jack why is this here So we have the hermit. Yeah, you, you, okay. Um, with this hermit card, this is giving me somebody that works best alone. Okay. And it's on top of the gully, gully jack card. So that's like, I believe that's hangman energy. I don't feel like this is you, though. Not my collective. Um, we oh, we got a lover's card in reverse. Okay, so for some of you who don't like your job and you're exploring your options, um, and or there's a divorce here, and so somebody had to get like real stern with somebody that they have a contract with. This is someone that they may work with, but I feel like this person wants to work with you, especially if you, if you in the office setting or something, somebody deals with charts. I'm also hearing a receptionist. The lover's car in reverse talks about a breakup. Okay. Um, it talks about disagreements disregard so if you left this person or a business uh, endeavor there you could be in court okay you may have mutual friends you don't want to hear what these people have to say all right um yeah I feel like there's a lot of gossip going on, arguments, altercation, because someone has little regard for consequences, or they don't, they don't, somebody feels like a victim in this situation, but this is something that they were attempting to manifest, and because it didn't go in their way, okay, they feel like a victim. How ironic is that? Father of Sam's in reverse. Either show me what it is I need to see. This is somebody that did. They overdid something. King of Knight of Swords. Oh, yeah. This is somebody that's argumentative. Okay. I feel like they're having somebody's. If this person wanted conflict, and it's not funny, y'all. But if this person was investing in confident in chaos spells or lies and manipulation, it definitely went back. It went back. Look at all the three of <laughs> three of cups in reverse talks about gossip. Too much, too much partying. Not enough planning. Feeling unsupported. So somebody wants to manifest a downfall on you collective or if this is about your person because you don't want to invest with them anymore. This caught this person off. This caught this person by surprise. They attempted to create so many obstacles and they're going to continue to do so. And then they're going to play victim. Because somebody needs to boss up in this situation. And I feel like you did. Somebody took their power back after going within. Relaxation is important because somebody wants you to be confused and chaotic. Some of you, you having to take a lot of spiritual baths or get in water, be by water. And the strength card revert. Yeah, because somebody overdoes. They, they, they overdo things. 
And when they don't get their way, they get vindictive. Knight of Swords on the fence. This is somebody that will get violent with you. Or this is you. They can't control their emotions here. They gossip a lot. Everywhere this person goes, it may even shift like the, the energy in the room may become really dreary. And somebody does not want to party or associate, uh, be in business with this person. For some of you, somebody that was working with someone you don't know, okay, wants to work with you, but they feel like you don't know they are involved. This is someone that you had to build up your defenses. This is a part of this five of sticks. They were a part of it. So keep that in mind. Somebody feels pressured. I feel like this person thinks if they work with you, it'll lighten their load or their karma because some, yep. Because somebody is like being tormented here. And it went right on top of that fire. Because you had endurance. They this is something that they did not see coming. Even though they either were doing divination to see how things would play out, and or they were doing divination to, to like break down your solar plexus. Your creativity. And it was a group of people. But I feel like people are backing out. Or they did in the past. They did in the past. They did, they did in the past. So somebody did something to mess with somebody's charts, analytics, or something. They did that in the past. Okay. This is surrounding your work. So somebody's trying to present an illusion, possibly in court. I know. So I know this person. So this person may have filed a report with the justice system. Okay. If you or like a reader. Somebody may be trying to use your work against you in court. <laughs> and they're having to change their approach. For some of you, you're waiting for the results of a reading. Or some paperwork being done. Maybe uh, uh, some finalization in an institution. Some of you, you're waiting for a divorce or this person is. They're thinking about you or you're thinking about this person. So you have strength, endurance, you know, to beat out this competition or these people that think that they're in competition uh, with you. Okay. Um, yeah, you're building something. And so here we have, yeah. So somebody definitely wants to partner with you, two of cups. For some of you, this is a higher level soulmate. But I feel like they have someone that they may have children with, or this could be their mother, that is working against you or against this partnership. Take it how it resonates. Because the, the queen of coins is here on the fence. Okay, this is somebody that's financially dependent on someone else. Um, this... Lover's cars has a for sale. So maybe somebody left the home. Somebody can't pay the bills. Okay. If they were trying to keep you in court for some property here, this person don't even have the sort, the income source to withhold this property or this business. Now they're tormented by a decision that they made. Yeah. This person may be have, having some delusion, depression, or something. If this is you, you're experiencing any DV, any legal issues, mental health issues, spiritual health issues, financial health issues. Seek out the proper authorities. This reading is for entertainment purposes only. 
And it's not to diminish anything that you are going through. It is to protect me legally. Okay. Somebody is building their own foundation. Okay. Again, you could be getting a new home. Um, rebuilding on a home. Starting to like manifest a foundation for the future. This is what you you are doing or this person is doing. And it's causing someone else to feel depleted, regretful, feeling like they missed out. Okay? Yeah. On this, In this deck, the emperor is a female. If you are a male, this is you using your creativity. You may be feeling like you missed out on the opportunity or somebody's feeling like they missed out on the opportunity with you. Because look, we got the unalive card in reverse. This is somebody that want to keep you stuck. Or, yeah, they didn't want something to end with you. And then someone else, someone unexpected, beat out the competition. Okay. Um, I just got low power mode. That's significant. This person was draining. Maybe draining your finances. Draining you of your creativity. This is somebody that you created some form of foundation with. Okay. So this is definitely about you... Um, this is this this is giving me twin flame. Uh, whether if you with your twin flame or not, um, you could you could decide to not be with this person. But you know, um, if that's the case, we got one twin that is like receiving good. I'm hearing judgment. Somebody has good judgment, but they're receiving good karma. And this other twin, they are like. Speaking their truth, standing up for themselves here. Um, both of you individual, whether you choose to be with this person or not, are avoiding false contracts and you're changing your perception or your perspective about partnerships. Okay? And somebody's definitely confused or conflicted. Um, you may be in this energy where you do not want to partner with anybody right now. You may have a lot of options. Some of you, you're going out on dates. You may not be wanting to nurture a current situation with someone. I don't know. Somebody could be or like a runner. I don't know if this person, like, she's a runner. She's a drying stone. But <laughs> Sorry. That's what I got. Um, <laughs> some of you, you know, you are choosing. You're the runner in this situation. You're running away from this partnership with your twin. Or they're running away from you. Um, you may be exploring your options going on dates. For some of you, this is like a contract here, like a house, a home, or something, and you don't even you don't want to invest in it, or or something like that, something like that. Seven of Wands, why is this here? Resentment, limiting beliefs. Okay, so somebody wanted you to self-sabotage. They wanted you to think negatively about whatever it is you are investing in. Or they wanted someone to think negatively about what you are investing in collective. I mean, I feel like I said the same thing. They wanted this person to think negative about investing in you. Okay, so this held this person up. I feel like somebody that they were in a collaboration with kept them stuck. Okay, they could have been in a partnership or they could have been partying too much. Um, they started releasing people. Okay, releasing people that were in a secret or a secret competition with you. But with this five of sticks here, I, I kind of feel like they never for some of you this, these people never really had a chance whether this person wanted to be with you or not um whoever this is they didn't see these people as marriage material or something like that so they had a false sense of power this may have been something that was hard for someone to digest to take in 
Somebody was trying to manipulate the situation or control you or control someone in this uh, dynamic here. But somebody feels powerless, but they, they had a false sense of security in the first place. Um, their ego, ego was... Mm -mm. Eight of coins, why is this here? Either show me what it is I need to see. Too many cards. Virtue, order, and patience. Okay, so that virtue, that's that temperance energy. So if somebody had to step back, learn how to fill uh, their own cup here. Uh, virtue may not have been something that this person valued or you valued okay but they were dealing with are you or this person that was very controlling okay and when you combined energies with this person or when this person combined energies with these people things got out of their control so they had a false sense of uh, security i'm here in this business for some of you this is people that they are they're in business with they may even be in court with we got virtue, order, and impatience. So somebody wanted something quick. Okay, so this person was sleep, sleep. They weren't thinking clearly. They were closed off. Now this person is feeling like a victim. Somebody operates out of fear, and that fear causes them to make bad, poor choices. Somebody is not confident that they could do something alone. Yeah, control and resentment. So somebody's resenting sacrificing you not coming towards you or you're resenting not working with this person somebody's very agitated okay um if somebody felt like they like they had the upper hand in a situation and that's why something is was underestimated here gully jack gichi the gichi could be gichi gully could be significant detachment so yeah i mean this is about letting go because somebody was power hungry, very competitive, very controlling. For some of you, some like somebody you were with were trying to control you, but they were being controlled in their own environment, whether they knew it or not, um, by in-laws, by family members, by coworkers. But they didn't see it like that because they somebody felt like they had the upper hand because they were waiting for something. Knight of Swords. For some of you, they were waiting for you and this person to get into it. That's what they were trying to manifest. They were trying to manifest you and this person argue or hate one of hate one of each other or something like that. Okay. Yeah. For some of you, somebody was using tantric to do so. They thought that they had control over this person. This would be somebody if you don't lay down with this person or if they don't lay down with this person, they get into an argument. That's how they that's how they feel like they had control uh, over this person. Uh, mother of coins. Or you feel like you had control over this person because they were attracted to you in a lustful way. Mother of coins, why is this here? Somebody's getting clarity. Adequacy. So we're talking about sufficient in quality or quantity to meet a need. Just barely sufficient in quality or quantity to meet a need or qualify for something. Yeah. Somebody don't want to nurture a situation um, with you. Or with this person, this property, this business, they don't feel like this is a good investment. They don't, somebody don't feel like this is the, the right fit for them. Okay. You're, you're pessimistic when it comes down to whatever this is. Okay. You may see someone as unstable. They may see you as stubborn, but there's a lesson here with this two of cups. There's a lesson for somebody to learn in this partnership, in this business proposal, in this marriage even. Okay? Yeah, so somebody's upset. If they marry someone, they're, they're losing a lot. They're losing a lot. Okay? And they may stay up at night thinking about that with this nine of swords here. Okay, seven a basket. They feeling like they made the wrong choice. 
Okay, this person may may have had or have commitment, even if they're with someone, they're not, they made this choice because they wanted some form of stability, maybe even a place to stay. Now somebody's losing all that and it keeps them up at night or it keeps you up. Happiness, can, commitment, <laughs> and courage. So I feel like this is my, connect, uh, my collective. If you are in a partnership, this could be what's taking place to someone that you were dealing with, but I feel like you're committed to whatever it is you are trying to build. And I'm not even going to go um, on those of you that are in a partnership because I feel I do feel like some of you, you are in a partnership with a higher level soulmate and you work well with this person. And so I'm not even going to touch on that. OK, but, you know, somebody's resenting a choice. OK. Um, five of six in reverse. Why is this here? I feel like I don't need this one. I feel like I need a different one. <clears throat> five of six in reverse. Why is this here? So somebody was hiding their involvement, okay? So somebody was pretending to be um, the right choice. They were pretending to be a, somebody's twin or a twin in general, okay? Um, this was somebody that was in competition with you and or your person. And they were doing so. What, what were they waiting for? I feel like this is uh, manipulation, confusion. Somebody wasn't thinking straight. So somebody was trying to uh, make you appear like you weren't resourceful or um, you weren't responsible or that your business would fail. And so this is what they were trying to conjure up. OK, this is like an imposter. This is someone that hides behind a fake profile. OK, they may even did some hacking. They were lying. OK, this is somebody from your past or this happened in the past. This is somebody that was jealous of your accomplishment or other people's accomplishment, because, again, they wanted to look like they were the better choice. Now, they're resenting some sort of action that they took surrounding some work, especially if they did something to block your work because it's showing up in their environment currently. OK, they were trying to throw you off focus. OK, with sapiosexual here, resentment and the they, they were trying to throw you off focus here. Now they're off focus. Why is the lover's card here? Are they going to be? Because mm, let me not lovers in reverse. Yeah. So they were doing this and they were acting as if it didn't matter. Something could have took place on a Saturday or specifically in October. The day of the unalive is significant. Somebody deals with gay day spirits. OK, so they were using um, like dark energy to manifest a breakup. OK, a ending. Most definitely. And now it's happening to them. They're having these endings. Of course, it's being done in secret. Somebody had rose colored glasses on. Now they're having to change their perspective about trying to keep you stuck or trying to sacrifice you. Child, keep acting like you don't see these readings or keep acting like it's not you. I'm not talking to my collective. I'm talking about the people that watch me and, you know, expect different results. All right, let me hurry up. Father of Sam's. Show me three of cups. Show me because my thing is going to. So they, they had a whole bunch of flying monkeys here. Now they have issues with all these people. OK, we got extended reality, altered realities, technology. So, yeah, somebody was messing with somebody's equipment. All right. Somebody lacked the education. You got to follow your dreams. They know the way. And we got a butterfly effect. So somebody kept trying to redo something from the past. And now they're not protected. OK. Um, let's get some parting before this cuts out. Either show me. We got medicine mother and the hunter. Okay, so this is taking place in the sun in the summer. Somebody is overly controlling, they need to surrender that need to control others and surrender the idea you can fix someone. It's time for a relationship to shift. 
It doesn't work to try to fix someone. Each person must be accountable for his or her own healing. Somebody is enabling others, okay, to do this malicious intent, thinking that they can fix something and it's not going to work. You're being guided to move forward or this person is deuces. 